We have natural pests in the room and because we have butterflies we're not able to use something like insecticide to take care of those pests. So instead we bring in natural items like bugs that are good and even button quail that'll help eat all of our ants. And so 11 button quail call the Sertoma butterfly house home. A lot of times the ants will pester the butterflies, especially when the butterflies are going to find their fruit that they eat. So if we're able to keep those ant numbers down, then the butterflies are going to be a lot happier as well. Mm -hmm. Trying to create a complete ecosystem here at the butterfly house and Part of that is balancing out all the different critters that live in here. And because we have ants, we also want to make sure that we keep those populations in control. So we bring in the button quail to help us make sure we don't get too many ants in the room. A native to Asia, these button quail are a win-win for the butterflies, the staff, and for visitors. It's great for the, the kids. It's something new. It's a new addition, and as long as it helps the butterflies, we're going to keep coming back. They're a, a really interesting animal, especially to watch them walk through the room. They call to each other. They'll follow each other around and look for bugs. And then they also are very fascinated by the butterflies. And they move fast. Kind of got to watch them. As a matter of fact, I just about stepped on one. <laughs> so they're, they're quick. You got to kind of watch where you're walking. But it's a good thing they keep the butterflies alone. The butterflies are really big to the quail. So even when the butterflies fly by the quail, they kind of duck for cover. They're, they're more worried about looking for ants and finding dirt baths rather than watching the butterflies.